Well, Morgan, what were your thoughts on today's game? Yeah, obviously, once we got the early goal, I thought that was going to spare us on. And considering after their result on Saturday, I thought they might crumble. But to be fair, they stuck at it. And I think we got a bit complacent. We got the early goal. And I think we thought they were just going to roll over and down. They'd done the total opposite. That, the goal kind of galvanised them and they pushed on and made it a hard night for us. That early goal was yours and what a cracking finish it was. Yeah, obviously it's nice to get a goal, but ultimately at this stage of the season, if we're not getting three points off it, then it kind of doesn't mean anything. And I'm not really that happy, to be honest. I'd rather the three points than me not scored than the other way around. So it was a quick start from the sides. Was this something you set out to do? Yeah, the gaffer's been telling us all week, try to get a quick start, obviously, off the back of their result. We thought the morale in their camp might be low, get a quick goal, and as I said, maybe they'd turn, up, turn over and then not try their best. But as I said, done the total opposite. They made the game hard for us. It's quite a scrappy team. Every time the goal, ball goes out of play, they make it difficult, they take long to get the ball back in play. And ultimately, they frustrated us. And then once they got a goal, I feel like they kind of just camped in and they was happy with a draw. Been a couple of games without a goal, but there's been a lot of positive signs about your partnership with Bruno and Angelo in behind. Is it just a matter of time before you, before you all start firing? Yeah, obviously we haven't played together for a while, but ultimately that Brett Bruno and Angelo are both brilliant players, so playing with them naturally, as I said, it's not about individuals at this stage of the season, it's about a team, so it doesn't matter who's scoring, as long as we're getting goals and we're winning, that's the most important thing really. And having talent like Michael Flevy and Joe Quigley sitting on the bench, it must spur you on to keep your shirt? Yeah, obviously, it keeps everyone on their toes, everyone knows, regardless, any at any moment they could be taken out of the team, and a player just as good as you can come in, so it keeps everyone on their toes, everyone training hard and everyone just got to be ready when they do get the opportunity to take it and try to keep it sure. Tranmere this weekend's a massive game with them sitting just above us. What will the thoughts be going into this? Yeah, obviously we've been in a tiny little blip, three draws in a row, but as I said, we don't, we don't fear anyone. We, we feel like we can beat anyone on our day, so Tranmere, we're going to give them their respect. We know they're a good team, but at the same day, as I said, on our day, we feel like we can beat anyone. So. We'll get a good day's training on Thursday and on Friday, then prepare for them and then give our best on Saturday and hopefully we get the win. Just a chance to really push up the table and get a result over one of our main rivals this year, sort of spare everyone on? Yeah, of course, obviously near the end of the season, Tranmere, you always know they're going to be up and around it, so if we can get a win over them, I know that'll take us above them, so at this stage of the season we can just really concentrate on ourselves every game. Now hopefully we can just pick up three points and then see where that ends us, takes us at the end of the season.